hopping people. Oh, what did I get? <gasps> Reading glasses. Oh my goodness. You gave me glasses? Thanks, Nerian. Is like, okay, put these on. Bloop. Yes. Nice. Those are pretty slick. Okay. Thank you. They handcrafted those? Just don't sell them. What does that mean? Glasses made from love from him and I. Oh, awesome. Thank you, too. You guys are awesome. Is that hard to make? I feel like those are hard to make. Save them for when you can glamour your gear. Yeah. I'm a Hrothgar of culture. No, I'm just nearsighted. <laughs> um, I'm a little bit myopic. We gotta go speak to Lewin. Return where you have stolen from me. Yeah, I'll unlock a glamour level where you can use. Yeah, so kind of like a transmog, right? Yeah. So I just got to make sure I don't get rid of them before then and now. Transmogs are the true end game, just like in Fashion Wars. Yeah. I gotcha. Very important. You love Hrothgar who dress up dapper like the beast? I'm pretty cool like this, though. I like this. That tabard is sweet. Yeah, it's new, too. Osiris, I won't remember that, but thank you. I don't even know what a Glamour Prime is, so I think it's pretty safe that I won't go buying one. I have waited your return, Bog. Allow me to thank you again for helping us defend the Guardian Tree. By the way, he looks like Carrie Elways, doesn't he not? Not only did they put the invaded exile to rout, you confronted the Masked Mage and fell his minion. And his fell minion. And emerge the victor. I have good men and women under me. None of... <laughs> do you? <laughs> Who's behind that desk? I have good men and women under me. None of which who would cause me complaint. But you, Bog, are a class apart. Your strength, your determination, your heart. You have all the makings of a great adventurer. Yonin is seldom mistaken in her appraisals. And she is plainly not mistaken now. Gridania is stronger for your presence. The Elder Seed Seer will doubtless be pleased to learn that a capable adventurer like you has come for us. Once again, I thank you. Woohoo! As you wish. Well, more like the Men in Tights version. Uh-oh, someone important. I am come to express my gratitude for your valiant efforts yeah, before acting. the Guardian Tree. Yeah, voice acting. That's how you know they're important. That's how you know they're important. There you go. <laughs> Connie, 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 Connie Senna. I am informed that an adventurer of singular talent now walks like my amongst glasses us. They made me. You are he, are I you didn't not? Even see that. Nary and Rolton That's Jeopardy great. made me glasses. I like that. That's fantastic. All right. I'm just going to call her Connie. Hey. Okay. Yeah. I am gonna I'm gonna close this I gotta vacuum. Okay. Real quick. Ten minutes off. 
My name is Khan A. Senna, and it is my solemn charge to watch over all who call Gridania home. Well met and welcome to our fair nation. <laughs> Should be welcome. It was your valor that won us the day, I believe. On behalf of all Gridanians, I offer you my humblest thanks. This gift I present to you as a small token of my gratitude. I hope that you will ever remain a friend to Gridania. This guy's the gift? I get him? It's air? No, I thought he was giving me him. <laughs> Green Bliss is coming. It is an age-old ceremony to renew the bond between man and elemental. Over the centuries, it has blossomed into a joyous festival encompassing Gridanians from every walk of life. I should be most gratified if you would participate in the ceremony as emissary. Only if I get to dance. Oh, such a great honor. I look forward to seeing you on that most joyous of days. Till then, fare you well. May you walk in the light of the crystal. So is she like a, is she a young human? She seems short. Gridanian ring. Direct hit rate plus one. Slashing resistance plus one. Not human, okay. Bum 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 bum. So, but look, I already got cool rings. I don't think that rings is good. Ooh, I get a Manoa mask? Let me guess, I can't wear a mask. She chose for you to play the role of emissary for God's sakes. You, an outsider, do you have any idea what this means? It means I need a new suit. you don't. You are not forest born, which is rather the point. Mistakes? Mistakes me not. I think you were worthy, but your selection is all but unprecedented. And I'll wager you have not the faintest inkling what is required of you. Yeah, I have no idea. There are preparations that the emissary must needs. I hate this phrase, must needs. It's very not natural to me. There are preparations that the emissary must needs. There's a lot of that going on in this game, too. Complete ahead of time. I suggest you consult Meowney regarding the matter. She is overseeing the arrangements for the event. Now, you had best get going. The ceremony cannot commence without the emissary. Oh, and Bog. Don't make a hash of this. But hash is delicious. Mmm, hash browns. Mm -mm -mm. There does seem to be the random inclusion of Elizabethan English. There is, yeah. And rock stars. Is there a sale going on for the complete edition on the Square Enix store, Renee's? Must needs. Yeah. Well, anybody who doesn't have the game must needs that. There was a sale at the end of last month. Uh, yeah, I got it. I got the complete edition for 60% off. Yeah. I'm gonna go consult with Meowney. Her 
Herdy Derp is dead in the fire. Okay. Got it. Where the hell am I? I have no idea. You've heard smoke on the water, but have you ever heard dead in the fire? Dead in the fire. Smoke on the water, dead in the fire. Look at the little pony corn. What is that little guy? That's cute. Hi, I'm Oswald. Oh my god, shiny dragon. There's so many fun things in this game. Or imp. I don't even know what that is. It's uh, like a limp without an L. It's a limp without an L? Yeah. All right, mother. Mother! All right, but let's speak of preparations. As doubtless already know, Green Bliss is an age-old ceremony for strengthening the bond between man and elemental. These days, though, the name also refers to the festival at large. In the ceremony, the emissaries serve as a conduit, a bridge between the people and the guardians of the Twelvewood. Suffice to say, it is no small responsibility, nor does the elder seed seer choose mankind's representative on a whim. Seldom in history have non-forest born have been chosen for this role, which should give you the idea of the magnitude of the honor being accorded to you. For your part, you are required to wear a ceremonial artifact, which is presently in the keeping of Timber Master Beaton. Go to the Carpenter's Guild, collect it from the man, then return to me for further instructions. Okay. So, where does this loop? All right, this is right around the corner. No problem. We can do it. Sprinting away. Do, 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 do. Hey, look, it's Adele. Are you inside this building? You're inside this building, aren't you? Aren't you? Hey, Mera Pamera. Hello, Beaton. So, you are the emissary to be. Mian and sent word that you'd be coming to collect the ceremonial artifact. The good news is that it's ready. Painstakingly crafted by these very hands, and from the rarest of materials. Take it, along with this warning. Get so much as a scratch on the thing, and I shall make an unceremonial artifact out of you. Okay, I feel like I made a friend. Did he really say that? He did. I like that. I, uh, I think I have a new friend. Surely one would not expect the Guildmaster to be outside of one of the buildings, eh? Well, I didn't know. This is by far the finest Manoa mask I've ever laid eyes upon. The Timber Master has truly outdone himself this time. In case you didn't mention, this mask is crafted from consecrated lumber rendered up by the guardian tree solely for use in the ceremony. In other words, it's priceless. Mother bids you to handle it with care. And with that, your preparations are complete. That's it? Why is everybody so nervous? All I need is a mask? 
Sweet. Uh, da, 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 da. Level 18. Action learn disembowel? Yes! That sounds like my kind of skill. For such a cutesy, like, fantasy game, like, do they really, like, they need to understand what this entails, right? <laughs> do we... <laughs> do we really need a disembowel skill? This game gets a little dark at times, I know, but it doesn't seem to fit at all. Okay. For my next skill, it'll be Drawn Quarter. Journey to Lavender Beds. All right, so can I put on the mask? Oh, it actually shows on my character. It's kind of creepy. The darkness comes later. Oh, this is a badass paladin guy. Look at this guy. Animaeus, Animaeus. Animaeus, Animaeus, Animaeus. All right. Conchito, Conchito Banano. I love to see fellow floor tank Sprouts starting up. Good luck. Thank you. Welcome to the stream. I guess uh, Sprouts is what you guys call new folks. Because you're not the first person to call me a Sprout. <laughs> yeah, Thorvaris was calling me a Sprout earlier. Um, How do I get to Lavender Beds? That's why you call them sprouts because I have this. Oh, I get it. Okay. What does it look like if you don't have that? Oh, you just don't have that. <laughs> That's the dumbest question I'll ask all day. What's it look like when you don't have that? Oh, you just don't have that. Returning players have a flower. Oh, interesting. Sprout. All right. So how do I get, since I'm a sprout and I need your help. How do you get to Lavender Beds? Look at this outfit. Holy crap, I have no idea what's happening. Oh my god. Azaria, where are you? Look at this outfit you can get. The flowers. You like the flowers? You should see her face. That's gorgeous. You like that? Ah, beautiful. <laughs> Piggy oh Pop's like, notice me! Oh my goodness! <laughs> Wait, I don't I'm even know what's happening. There is something about Pinky Fluff's character yeah. that just honestly makes me want to put like my like my like my hands to my face and so oh, it's so cute. Yeah. It really is. I love yay, it. Yay. I love it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. She's screaming at you. What was that? That's what? That. This thing? Yeah. Um, that's the guy in the chocobo outfit, it oh, looks like. With Moogle shoes? With Moogle slippers. Yeah. Looks like it. And a badass sword. Don't ignore the sword part. There's so much to look at. It's very, this game is very distracting. It's really distracting. Oh my God, someone's a Moogle! What? Someone's a Moogle! Who's the Moogle? Who's the Moogle? Oh, who's the Moogle? Hardy Derp. Oh my god, Hardy Derp! You're a fancy little moogle. That's great. I can never play this game on stream because everyone would have to mute me because it would literally just be filled with me just going, Come here, come here! Has Arya made a character yet? I think. Did you make a character? No, I oh. haven't. I haven't, no. Uh, to be to be 100% honest we with you. We have to talk classes and stuff, yeah. I, um. Or jobs. I would like to do that. Probably later on when I have him with me. Because he, he's gonna have more experience. And he'll 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 know what I wanna play. 
That's kind of true. Yeah. Which is, I don't understand how, but he knows what I want to play. All right, I'm gonna let you go because I gotta. Go See ya. Okay, so where do we go? How do I get to lavender beds? Yeah, I know you can level everything on one character, but she won't do that. She's not gonna level all the classes. Remember the fairy? Totally. That's the player housing. I know, but how do I get there? Step one. Step one would be... Is it next to the Lancer's Guild? Oh, okay. See, that's step one. Go to Lancer's Guild. What job will Azar play? We don't know yet. Oh, I have to talk to the guy at the end of the pier instead of the actual boat. That's so weird to me. It's like, there's the guy on the boat. Seek passage to the lavender beds. And now I can go. No. God. This ferry is presently out of service. <laughs> okay. That is so annoying, square Y. You have to go where you picked it up. You need to go to the skipper in Bent Branch then. Then. Why do they want? Why do they make it hard for people to get into the game? From the from the account creation <laughs> to signing in your first time to stuff like this. Why? All right, I need I need dummy proof instructions. I need literally like do this, do this, do this. Use your telebranch skill to go to Bent Branch. I don't even know where Bent Branch is. Hey, old man Harley. 100% agree. They need to change the new player experience. Yeah. Open the teleporter menu. So by clicking on this. Oh, this. Okay. Here we go. Central Shroud. Okay, Central Shroud. Okay. And then... Down here? Yes. Oh, that's just a porter. How do I? I thought I could rent one. It's okay, it's not that far. Let's just go. It's a beautiful day out. Arrowwolf says, I don't know. The clunky newbie experience has really helped the veteran's kindness to shine. It's working. Well, there you go. But if you weren't streaming, if you're not streaming, you don't have, or you don't have friends like helping you, I could see this as a log off opportunity. It's like, oh, I don't know how to get there. I'll figure this out some other time. Log off. Another opportunity to get sucked into a different game. Arcana Law says, hey, Abog, for some reason, I thought you played Final Fantasy 14 before. Well, I started last Friday. That was my first stream uh, ever of it. 
Um, I did play Final Fantasy, the MMO, before Realm Reborn. So I played it way, way long time ago, but never since Realm Reborn. Each of the three destination nations has established a residential district where like-minded adventurers can establish a base for their activities. Each residential district is divided into wards, which turn, which in turn house 60 plots of land each. Wealthy individuals may purchase plots of land, okay. Estate halls and apartments can be customized. customized. Just pick one of them. All right, Toronto Cat. Oh, one of the wards. The um, 12th ward. Select. Yes. Marauder says, I've had many log off opportunities. They don't seem too concerned about them. I guess not. Yeah. They do that to free up the queue. Here we go. I made it. Lavender beds. I like the, I like the music. The picker of Lux. guys all right so where here do we need to go speak with the serpent recruit did you put on a swimming suit Probably should have stayed where I was, right? Oh, let me get this too. Oh. Oh, damn. Greetings, adventurer, and welcome to Lavender Beds. Oh, you come at the behest of a Gradanian woman? I regret to inform you that these plots are reserved for adventurers. Your friend will not be permitted to take part in the auctions. You, on the other hand, would be more than welcome to participate. Should you have a mind to purchase a plot for yourself, pray speak with the resident caretaker. He can guide you through the process. Okay. It auto-tunes you here? Okay, got it. Now they want me to go all the way back out? That's all they want me to do? Just come here and leave. It was just unlocking it for you. Ah. All right. I don't know where I want to go, though. Get me back out of here. Unless I wanted to look around. It's just going to show me a whole bunch of stuff I won't be able to get. It's just going to tease me. All right, here we go. Margeria. 
Good to see you again, friend. Did you learn anything about the lavender beds? Yeah, I can't afford anything. Oh, adventurers only? Oh, is that so? Well, these are trying times, and it's more important than ever for Gridania to attract capable of individuals like yourself. I'm sure that one day my dreams will come to fruition. One day, I'll have my own cottage and stables filled with my beloved chocobos. Yay! Lavender beds, ethernet now accessible. I got an achievement. Storyteller. All right, renewing the covenant. Sure, it's worth the money. Oh, that's attorney. That's the wrong one. Just drop this quest. Uh. How do I get rid of it? Map, quests, link, quest, and chat. How do you abandon a quest? Oh, well, it's not in my journal anymore. Here we go. Got it. No. Oh, you just hide it? Oh, that's all you do? Okay, you hide it. This one is also in here. It's back to Mother Mione. You can't abandon that one. Ah, okay. She has some final words of advice. Now that you have the Manoa mask, all that's left is to participate in the ceremony. Perchance you are feeling nervous, but never feel fear. Despite all the pomp surrounding the role, there's really nothing to being an emissary. All you require to do is wear the mask, stand up straight, and look dignified. The more involved aspects of the proceedings will be handled by others. Simple, no? The ceremony will be held at Miketo's Amphitheater. When you're ready, make yourself known to the caretaker there, a woman named Estain. Oh, and be sure to wear your mask. She may not recognize you. Now, off you go. All right. A stain. No. So where is that, though? Levies are basically repeat all quests you don't need for your first character. It's mainly alt stuff. Okay. Or for currency, not for now. See, what's confusing to me is when I click this, it shows me this map, which is completely different than where I am right now. You know what I mean? You can click on your map, yeah. I click it on the big map. Okay, so I click this, and then I click the big map, and then, but I still have no idea how to get there. So I see myself here, so I just gotta go up north. I can use the internet too, but I don't know where. You don't know which one.
the U ethernet UI is getting an overhaul in a few weeks. All right. I have all these, right? I think I ran around and I got them all. All right. Well, we'll get used to it eventually, I guess. A stain. Ah, you must be the emissary. You see my mask, right? I see you have come prepared that as well. When you press M, it shows a zoomed in version of the local map. There's an up arrow on the upper left side of the map that will take you up one level and you can see where you are plus where the zones connect. Wait, can I escape out of this? No. I've been instructed to escort you to your place. Please follow me. Look. Oh, good. We got voice acting. The elder seats here. Twelve bless her heart. And me. Who's that strapping young man? out of her clothing. May he find favor with the elementals. Yeah, sparkles. I like my tooth. This Radiance. Could it be a crystal of light? Mine. Atma Prime, thanks for following, by the way. Tell me true. Has the Mother Crystal revealed herself to you? Did you bask in her light? Well, I don't mean to kiss and tell, but... Have you, perchance, experienced sensations akin to ether sickness of late? He's like, that I don't Heidelin know. would speak directly to this man. Well, that's the that's the the woman's voice from the beginning, the one that says feel, right? No? There once were dauntless adventurers who fought in the name of Eorzea. Yes? Oh, yes. Okay. Not confused. Yeah, hear, feel, think. Yeah, okay. There once was dauntless adventurers who fought in the name of Eozor. Uh, Eorzea. When the primals threatened to bleed the land dry, these brave men and women rose to face them. When the Garlean Empire resumed its war of conquest, they rushed to the realm's defense. And when it was foretold that Dalamud would fall, they fought with all their strength to deliver us from certain doom. Yet as strong and as brave as they were, they, like so many, disappeared amidst the flames at Cartano. None have forgotten the heroes who gave all for the sake of a realm, not their own. Yet when we try to recall their names, we find the pages of our memories are blank, as if bleached by the sun. Those were the people's characters <laughs> before Realm Reborn that got wiped out. <laughs> And when we try to recall their faces, we see them only in silhouette, as if they stood betwixt us and a blinding glare. Hey, it's very accurate. It's very accurate because I had a character and I have no idea what race or what it was or what the name was. So yeah, it worked. Flashy thing. It's like erase your memory. Hence, have these heroes come to be known 
as the warriors of light. Interesting camera angle. Oh, better. Beholding you, illuminated by the glow of the crystal, I could not help but be reminded of them. The crystal has chosen you for a purpose. Trust to its guiding light, and all shall be revealed to you in good time. Her necklace looks like an upside-down cutesy cow face? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> now I can't unsee that, ever. It totally does. With a little party hat on. <laughs> it's very true. Hey, Jogs, what's going on? Yep, you're welcome. Though none can say for certain what the future will bring, it is my belief that you may yet play a telling role in the tale of this great realm. For the power <laughs> of the Echo again. resides within you. Is that my stomach? No. Uh oh. Creepy sky. Death Star. Uh oh. Flames to the fore. Robon. Oh, is this? Oh, good. I can I can stop here for a second. I just need to get a bottle of water. A time says random question. Did you make this character on a preferred server? I don't think so. You mean the one they recommended to me to start? I don't think so. I don't know. I don't remember. Victory belongs to the bold. Show those imperial whore sons what we're made of. The left flank buckles. Divert the Barracudas. Barracudas? Barracudas? Bid them hold that position, though it cost them their lives. The Yellow Serpents are in need of succor. Pray, send the White Wolves to their aid. The adventurers risk life and limb for our cause. We must not fail them. Upside down cow. They're cute barracudas. Barracudas. Is Artemis? <laughs> Is Autumn <laughs> and frolicked in the autumn mist in the land called Hanali? Barracudies? Hey, McSwarlden. Sucker is such an ugly word. It is, but I've been I've been encountering that word since I was a kid with Dungeons and Dragons. No, it is nothing. <laughs> oh, bloody hells! Damn. The barrier won't go down so easily. Eyes forward. Who's that man? Who's standing up there? We are being watched. That was you, Marauder, up there? Okay, cool. Just watching me. Raging Bull, calling Bloodthorn. Bloodthorn, respond! Respond, damn you! Raging Bull, 
This is Mad Snake. Respond. Ryder! This is Raging Bull. What news? We're surrounded by a blaze. There is no way out. God preserve, what is that thing? What's going on? Speak to me! God damn it! We cannot hold much longer! Mad Snake! I Mad think, Snake! I think Mad Snake is dead. Answer me! Snake! Damn it! Damn it all to the seventh hell! <laughs> what of the Barracudas? Can they not be reached? <laughs> My favorite character right here, Merle Wib. Merle Wib and her Barracudas. <sighs> Dear directors, we are capable of detecting historical replay without the use of Sepia's own. Sorry, Admiral. Shell's not working. What of our own? I cannot say, my lady. That monstrosity appears to be disrupting our communications. We must keep trying. Call till they respond. Yes, my lady. Admiral, General, we can do no more. We must give the order to withdraw. I will not forsake Louis Swan. Louis Swan. General, please. Victory may belong to the bold, but there will be no victor this day. You know this to be true. Let us not sacrifice lives in vain. The adventurers fight bravely, but to no avail. Let them withdraw, and let us be the ones to stand with Louis Swan. Delay previous orders. All Maelstrom units are commanded to fall back effective immediately. Okay. Give the foreign levy priority. Let the main host cover their retreat and bring up the rear. Damn it. Relay the order. All flames are to withdraw. I don't care if our link cells are useless. You still have a working pair of legs, don't you? Well, use them, you bloody halfwit! So Link Shell is the little, like, communicator. That's why you can have Link Shells that, with your friends and stuff like that, you can kind of communicate through, uh... uh I get it. Okay. I was, I was wondering why. I'm like, why do they call it a Link Shell? The outcome of this battle was long since decided. So how long ago is this taking place? You had that light bolt moment too, Bog? Yeah, it's just, it's some of the nomenclature is weird and then they explained it and you're like, all right, so this is five years earlier? Okay. If I haven't seen it before, I, I did watch the Realm Reborn cinematic last Friday though. And I'm old, so that could have been like five years ago. Yeah. So this is back during that trailer. Better to retreat now than risk a massacre. Have you considered getting good? Hey Merm, what's going on? And that 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 um that like old elf looking guy, he created this bubble, right? And then didn't he kind of get absorbed by the bubble or something? Yeah. Oh, the old elf is Louis Swa. Oh, okay. That's who they're talking about. This dark, stifling presence. Who or what? Can I ask a dumb question? 
how would you know any of that your first time playing? Like, obviously you guys know because you're you've been playing this game for years. But like, like from a new player's perspective, I have no idea who any of these people are. <laughs> and they're talking about Louis Swan. I like, I don't. I would never have put that together that that's the guy from the trailer. <laughs> You find out as the game goes on. Okay, so you're supposed to be like bewildered at this moment, right? Okay, you're with me, Sport McSwald. All right. You don't. It's not told super well. I enjoyed everything so much more in a second playthrough because I had context. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, because I have. It's just basically a bunch of random people. I have no idea who they are. Yeah. We go to take our place beside Archon Louisois. To your positions. Okay. Kazbamul, so ginin moise donzul. That I should live to behold Bahamut once more. Logalo Asawad Deken Bet Mubud. Magnificent, the aeons of imprisonment have only made him hunger. Imarat way. Kiskatoga Hats Wadadorns. I am aware of them, pay them no mind, they are powerless to act. It has begun. Soon the planet will regain its true form. So these are Askians? Is that how you say their name too? Askians? I was making it Askians because otherwise it's like similar to Asians. <laughs> All right, so they're Asians. <laughs> All right. <laughs> hey, Danimal, what's going on? All right, Mother Meoni. Look who's back in the land of the living. So what happened? I just had a bad dream. You mean to say you don't remember a thing? You collapsed in the middle of the ceremony, gave us all a good fright, so we carried you back here. I must say, you're heavier than you look. Uh, thanks? You've hardly stopped of late. Your exertions have caught up with you. They call you fat? Kind of. They said you're heavier than you look. I don't know. That might be a compliment, but it's not a great compliment. Uh, but you adventurers are nothing if not resilient. Seeing as the worst is past, I shall take my leave and return to my duties. Oh, I almost forgot. The elder seats here told me she'd like to see you when you felt well enough. The gentle soul was almost as worried about you as I was. Bless her. You're back on your feet. Be sure you visit her at the Lotus Stand. Okay. That was my otter making noise. Hey, look, I'm back here. My toy chest. I have not unlocked any toys. My armoire. Store an item, remove an item, nothing. Store an item. I don't know. Glamour dresser. I've not unlocked it. Sweet! This is such a fun room. I'm not on. I can't do that either. Or that. This I can do. But I've got no music. Most unfun room ever. <laughs> that is the room of teases. Garaka says, have you ever seen two giraffes fight? They're all muscle. 
I actually have seen it. It gets pretty scary with them swinging their heads. Yeah, it's the room of don't touch that. It's like a museum. Everything's very clean. You can't touch anything. Okay, so where are we going? Up here. Is this what Evil Twin Link was saying? Okay, so it's that away. It's still, uh still a little obtuse to me under the name of the map there are more layers hey big red tom what's up how you doing okay so here's the quest i want to do this is where i am right So this is the south of... Can I just go right here? The Conjurer's Guild? I can. There we go. Sweet. I figured something out. Already lying to me. This is not a very silent Conjurer. Ah, you are Bark Otter, are you not? I beg you welcome, sir. The Elder Seedseer left word that you'll be joining her at the Lotus Stand. May I show you in? Yes. Thank you. Yeah, the non-silent conjurer. Oh, this is a pretty place. So I should be a conjurer. This is where they hang out? I have looked forward to your coming, Bog. But tell me, are you recovered? I am most glad of that. I said no. <laughs> now I hope you will now, you will no doubt, what? I hope you will not doubt the earnestness of my concern, but I will ask a favor of you. Nor can I deny that I summoned you here in part with this in mind. Know, however, that I proceed only upon the understanding that you are rested and well. Dun, 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 dun. 